Alexia here. Thank you for joining me on ADM Quotes Life Stories. Today marks the first of the ADM QLS podcast series, and this is Podcast Zero. The beginning of what I hope to be an awesome experience for us all. So, why did I start this series? Well, you have to thank my therapist for that. Basically, he took a look on my website, um, which is mainly focused on my novels, other books and movies and things like that. And he asked me, have you ever thought about doing this? You should do a podcast. And so here I am, months later, putting together a podcast series. So let's talk about content. Since I'll be continuing to discuss my work, books, movies, and related things of that nature over on my website, I I wanted to focus on other things here. Essentially, I'll read a quote, then I'll talk about life or tell a story related to this quote, and I'll tell you if the story is true or a work of fiction, although I may also do this in reverse. So I may tell you a story or talk about life and then give you a quote that relates to it. I'll still tell you if the story is truth or fiction, but the order really depends on the day. So, um, I'll give you a story by saying something like story time, um, and a life topic or subject by saying something like, let's talk about life. I think you probably get the gist of it. As far as my schedule goes, I'm going for a podcast Saturday, mainly because this is my favorite day of the week. Interestingly enough, I was born on a Monday. I hate Mondays. You know what's more interesting than that, though? though? My best friend of almost um, 12 years now uh, was born on my favorite day of the week, so Saturday. And her birthday is my birthday backwards. So, like, her birthday is 9-10 and mine is 10-9. Pretty cool. Coincidence? I think not. I don't believe in them. Anyway, I plan to have lots of fun and delve into a lot of topics from this podcast setup. So this may be the most terrifying, fun, odd, and satisfying thing I've done since I decided to add it to actually publish my books. I'm insanely introverted, enough to get bullied for it in college, of all things. So this is sort of a big deal. (laughs) Um, I'm pretty sure I'll survive this because all of you will be safely hidden away on the other side of the screen or your device you're listening on. So that's pretty good for me. (laughs) Is this going to solve my introversion issue? Probably not. I mean, I've tried for my entire life and anyone who knows me will tell you a bunch of stories where I essentially didn't exist. (laughs) Obviously, I do. But that's beside the point. The better question is, if I see you all on the street one day, will I scurry away as quickly as possible? Mm, Maybe. But if you approach me softly, calmly, with caution, I just might play dead or, you know, pretend I'm invisible or whatever. But, you know, if I get that far, it's still progress, right? Right? I mean, I don't know what you said, but I'm going to pretend that you agree with me anyway to, like, make myself feel better. So thanks. You're amazing. Amazing. I like you already. Why don't you just stick around forever? No, really. Stay. Forever. Okay, well, (laughs) that got a little weird. Well, if you like weird meaningful conversations and your favorite day of Saturday just might have found your place. (laughs) I get called weird like all the time so you know I've learned to start to embrace the weird. Um, I feel like everyone who's weird learns to embrace it before they know that they've learned to embrace it but that's like a topic for an entirely other day. (laughs) Anyway so I think that pretty much wraps up this introduction. Um, And, you know, check out my website at admcreations.com.
um, for other content, you know, all the book stuff, advice about writing and all that good stuff, um, you can get in contact with me via the contact page, um, or you can send an email to admauthorcreations with an S at gmail.com. So, see you in podcast one, maybe, maybe, I, I think you want to come, you should come. It's going to be fun. <laughs>